Hey everyone, welcome back to Wrath of Math. I'm your host, Sean Ian, and today's video will be answering the question, what is a bipartite graph? There are a lot of different kinds of bipartite graphs, but in this video we're just going over basic bipartite graphs, so hopefully by the time we're done you'll be familiar with their definition and know what these types of graphs are. I'll also mention that bipartite graphs are sometimes referred to as bigraphs, but we're going to call them bipartite graphs during this video. So let's get into it. We know that a graph is an ordered pair with a vertex set V and an edge set E, as we've said many times. Then this generic graph G is bipartite if and only if there exists a partition of its vertex set into two disjoint sets we'll call V1 and V2, such that every edge in the graph joins a vertex from one set to a vertex in the other set. This means that there are no adjacent vertices in V1, and there are no adjacent vertices in V2. If two vertices are adjacent, then one of the vertices is in V1, and the other is in V2. If we can find a partition like this of a graph's vertices, then it is a bipartite graph. So to try to make that clearer, let's use some visuals. A graph is bipartite if you can separate its vertex set or partition its vertex set into these two sets we call V1 and V2. And let's just draw some vertices in there. So the graph is bipartite if you can partition its vertices in this way so that every edge in the graph goes from this set to this set. Every edge joins a vertex from V1 to a vertex in V2. If you can partition the vertices in this way, then it is a bipartite graph. Something a little tricky with bipartite graphs is that it's not always obvious by drawing the graph that it is a bipartite graph. So this graph is a bipartite graph, but it doesn't necessarily jump out at you. But you can see if we partition its vertices in this way, then indeed that demonstrates that it's a bipartite graph because every edge goes from this set to this set, from this set to this set, and so on. You see how this works. So because we can partition the vertices in this way, where every edge goes from here to here, it is a bipartite graph. But let's look at an even less obvious one. So this graph here is bipartite. And if you want a little challenge, then take a second to pause the video, look at the graph, and try to see a partition of the vertices that demonstrates that this is a bipartite graph. Now I'm basically about to give the answer away, so if you're satisfied, let's swipe over here. So this is the graph from the previous page, but I've labeled the vertices. I'll just swipe back and forth. You can see clearly it's the same graph. I've labeled some of the vertices A1 through A4, and I've labeled some of the vertices B1 through B3. And I've drawn the vertices down here as well, so we can fill in the edges and see that indeed this is a bipartite graph. So let's start drawing the edges and see if it checks out. So we'll start with A1. We see that A1 is adjacent to B1 and B2 and B3. So let's draw those edges. A1 goes to B1, A1 goes to B2, and A1 goes to B3. Now we'll move on to A2 right here. A2 is also adjacent to B1, and it's adjacent to B2. So we'll connect A2 to B1, and we'll connect it to B2, just like that. And now we'll look at A3, and we see that A3 is adjacent to B3, and it's adjacent to B2. So let's draw those edges. A3 gets connected to B3, and it gets connected to B2. And then lastly, we have A4, and A4 we see is just adjacent to B2. So we'll draw A4 getting connected to B2, and you can see clearly here every edge goes from this set to this set. Thus, because we were able to partition the vertices in this way, this graph here is a bipartite graph. Honestly, I think it's pretty cool. You could sort of make a game out of it, you know, draw some crazy graph and challenge your friends to find the partition that demonstrates that it's a bipartite graph. Now, wouldn't that be a fun and wild way to spend a Saturday evening? In any event, I hope this video helped you understand what bipartite graphs are. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, need anything clarified, or have any other video requests. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and be sure to subscribe for the swankiest math videos on the internet. I can't wait for